so we, uh, we, we're going to take a... All right, so you saw Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo booed by law enforcement officers. This is as she was leaving commissioner's court because she said she was feeling sick. Well, deputy constables showed up by the dozens with a message that they were hoping would be heard. Fox 26's Gabby Hart joining us live from commissioner's court with more on what unfolded there today. Gabby. Yeah, well, those deputies showed up because law enforcement find, uh, funding was on the agenda for today. However, two commissioners didn't show up to today's meeting. Uh, so Judge Hidalgo said since no one or there would be no progress made uh, that she was too sick to stay in that meeting. Well, on Tuesday afternoon, Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo was booed by a crowd after she ended a county commissioner's meeting early. People get sick, okay? I didn't ask to be in the, an emergency room twice, uh, twice in one week. Dozens of deputies showed up to the meeting holding a banner that read, Stop Defunding. These law enforcement officers were hoping they'd get to speak and call for no law enforcement funding to be cut or reallocated. But because two county commissioners, Jack Cagle and Tom Ramsey, were absent, they were unable to move forward with setting any sort of budget. And because Judge Hidalgo wasn't feeling well, she just left early. Part of the reason I came against doctor's orders was in the hope that one of my colleagues would show up and we'd be able to pass the budget to be able to fund 8.25% in races, to be able to fund $100 million in uh, prosecutors, in constables, in police officers. Godspeed. We hope you, yeah. you do well. I'm getting better. Yeah. I just need to take a little rest. Thank, Thank you. you all so Thank much. Thank you. So we, uh, we, we're going to take a... Uh, the deputies who showed up all left the meeting shortly after Judge Hidalgo with no resolve. One of the missing commissioners, Jack Cagle, released a statement saying in part, my presence at this meeting would mean my consent to a tax rate that would cost taxpayers an additional $257 million. I will make this as clear as I can. I will not negotiate with a knife to my throat. Commissioner Rodney Ellis, who was at today's meeting, sent a statement of his own saying, quote, we can't debate people who don't show up, and we can't discuss a plan that doesn't exist. They are forcing Harris County to gut vital services and playing a dangerous game with the lives, health, and safety of Harris County families. Yeah, now those deputies did say on their way out that they plan to come back the next time law enforcement funding is on the agenda, and they'll make sure that they have their voices heard. I'm live in downtown Houston, Gabby Hart, Fox 26 News.